New York City public schools faced unexpected disruptions due to a temporary migrant shelter set up at a high school in Brooklyn. Around 1,900 asylum seekers were relocated to the school for safety during a storm threat, with raising concerns about potential flooding at their previous shelter. The decision to switch the students to remote learning for the day drew mixed reactions. Some parents expressed frustration at the disruption, while others empathized with the need to prioritize the migrants' well-being. The incident also sparked debate online, with some individuals, including Elon Musk, criticizing the city's handling of the situation. However, others pointed out that housing migrants in temporary shelters is not uncommon, citing examples from Massachusetts and other states. Meanwhile, New York City continues to wrestle with the influx of migrants arriving at the U.S.-Mexico border. The city has been working to provide temporary housing and essential services, while also seeking support from the federal government and neighboring cities and states. Governor Phil Murphy of New Jersey has recently declined requests to accept migrants from New York City, further highlighting the challenges of managing the migrant crisis across state lines. Mayor Eric Adams has responded to the pressure by reversing planned budget cuts to the New York City Police and Fire Departments, citing the need for additional resources to manage the influx and ensure public safety. Thanks for watching. Like, comment and subscribe for more information.